Hi there, Susan C, mentor for moms, and I'm here to talk about an idea around how to be intentional in your marriage when life gets busy. You see, we have busy schedules and we have lots of responsibilities in our home taking care of our kids, yet we want to make sure that our relationship, our marriage is strong. So how do we do that? How do we make sure that happens? Well, so many people give advice and they recommend that couples have a date night. I actually love that idea. I think it's fantastic. Here's the challenge. What do you do when the kids are little? They need you when work schedules conflict, when things get crazy, and date night just feels like another thing that's not happening and another place where you're failing. Then what do you do? Well, I'm here to offer you a different perspective. I happen to um, have been in that experience for years. My husband and I, since we have seven children, we had years where we just had lots of little ones around and trying to get away and go out almost felt like a bigger deal than just staying at home. It was like trying to get everybody packed up and everybody happy and good and off to someone. And then we go off to somewhere and have dinner while remaining mindful of the time so we can go back and pick them up and come home and settle them down, get them to bed, and then call that a good night. You know, every time I thought about it, I just would go right over to the couch and have a seat and go, that's okay, let's just stay home. But what I became to realize over time was that it really wasn't about the date night. Really, it wasn't. It was about he and I finding ways to honor our relationship and make sure our marriage maintained a priority in our lives and it didn't get lost in the doings and the comings and the goings of our day and our schedule. Instead, we got to focus in and be intentional about spending time with each other. Intentional about letting one another know you're top of my mind. I'm thinking about you when we're not together. And then we got to be creative in ways that we found to do that. You see, in that perspective, a date night just became one tool. It didn't become the goal, it became a goal in a sea of ideas of ways that we could support one another and love one another and enrich our relationship. We began to get excited about sending each other notes through the day, about sending a quick email or sending a text message, about sending over little love notes on the pillow and leaving them for one another about taking the time in the morning before my husband leaves for he and I to join hands and to pray together each day. When you read a scripture and we get an insight, we share it with one another. Some of those evenings when we can just have a moment where we sit on the couch and just have a good conversation, sometimes about much of nothing. We just wanna be together. There are also times where we would have our family meal, where we would, the kids would eat like kid food like something that they're happy to eat, right? And then he would go out and bring home something that was more adult, something that we just loved and enjoyed. And maybe we would have gone to get if we went to a restaurant, but we decided to have it at home. Sometimes we would set the kids up with a kid movie and then we'd go watch an adult movie. There's so many different ideas that we can come up with to have a way that we honor the relationship. And we just get to make that the goal date night. It's not a place where we fail. It's a goal that we want to achieve at the right time, when it feels good, when we get to come home from it and feel great about it versus feeling exhausted because we had to run the kids over here and get them over here and be mindful of the time and get back in time. And you know, instead of all of that, we just say, hey, that's not the season for us to go out. So what other ways can we find to enrich our relationship and let each other know you're important to me and that I know in my heart I'm important to you. I hope this supports you. I hope this is an encouragement to you. If you find yourself in a season where date night just ain't happening or you just find that overwhelming to even think about, I want you to remember that perspective. Date night is just one way that you can have a thriving relationship. There are multiple ways to have your relationship be a priority and you can be intentional in your marriage even when life gets busy. Bye for now.